Hello, and I'd like to welcome you all once again to the old schoolhouse here in the village of Butterstone, or the hamlet of Butterstone in Perthshire in Scotland, for another one of our wee Saturday night uh, half hours. And uh, this will be number 115. Can you believe that? Anyway, yeah, 115, and um, so it's brilliant. And I hope, you've all, hope you're all well and been looking after each other. Uh, could you please welcome to the stage the wonderful Thai faces who are going to be accompanying me tonight, as always. And uh, you might notice that they're, very, they're looking very chuffed with themselves, very pleased with themselves. And that's because today we just took delivery of some tatty face fridge magnets and some tatty face key rings. <laughs> and they're absolutely thrilled. And on the back of the key ring, it says, smile like a tatty face, isn't that? <laughs> so <laughs> the, <laughs> we've been having great fun with the tatty faces over the last um, 115 shows. And so now we've got fridge magnets and, and key rings. And it was a bit hard negotiating with them for the their kind of copyright. They're pretty strict when it comes to that, you know, and the, the percentage <laughs> that, they, that they were wanting. But uh, well, we've managed to come to an agreement. So I thought I would start off with this song, just to kind of waken up the vocal cords. It's been terrible weather here. It's just absolutely terrible. And, uh, it's very it's a bit cold in the old schoolhouse here tonight. Here we go. All eyes are empty, they hide the heavy heart. And who fakes the broken dream before it falls apart? And all things equal. It may concern the child will lose the place, and time will never learn. Hide away, don't hide away. It's just the price we have to pay when nothing seems too clear. It's so close, but never near. Hide away. we started from to resolution and all things equal Useless to ignore the well known stranger who is waiting at your door. Oh, we stand in silence. Oh, how could we be here waiting in the shadow light for nothing to? Hide away, don't hide away It's just the price we have to pay When nothing seems too clear It's so close but never near Hide away, don't hide away So many foolish things they say From the place we start
And all things equal To whom it may concern The soldier leaves the post The jury will adjourn And all faults forgotten And old fools won't repent As around their jaded words They're lighter with intent Hide away, don't hide away It's just the price we have to pay When nothing seems too clear It's so close but never near Hide away, don't hide away So many foolish things they say we start from I think we'll do it one more time you can join maybe you can say it with me go on try hide away don't hide away it's just a price we have to pay oh when nothing seems too clear it's so close but never near hide away don't hide away so many foolish things they say From the place we start from To resolution Thank you very much, and uh, that's uh, my wee song, Resolution. Here, I'm, I'm just assuming now, I've been after number 115 broadcasts, I'm, assu I'm assuming that you're having a wee applause to your laptop or your phone that you're... Uh, that you're uh, I'm getting the vibe here, I'm, I can feel that, actually. Uh, I'm going to continue with a couple of songs, and... Uh, And these songs, <laughs> so, uh, these songs are kind of connected, the next two songs. And uh, I, I thought I would do this. It's not a song I, I do very often. But it's nice to revisit old songs. This is a very old song of mine. And, uh, and it's kind of nice to revisit it. And uh, when I was growing up, I, my, I knew my, that we, we knew that uh, the McLean side of my family came from the island of Mull. But we, were, we had no information and, and we, we weren't very sure. And uh, my own grandfather spoke Gaelic, so English wasn't his first language, and uh, he spoke Gaelic. And uh, in fact, we called him Shenner, which is Gaelic for grandfather. And, uh, and I'd always assumed it was my grandfather who had come from the island over to the mainland. Um, but uh, we, we called him Shanner, and we used some wee Gaelic words through, as we were growing up. And uh, it was actually quite exotic to have a Shanner. You know, when I was at school, you know, all the other kids had granddads and gran, you know, grannies and granddads, you know. But I had a Shanner, and um, nobody really uh, you know, understood what I was meaning when I was talking about uh, you know, going away up the hills with my Shanner. You know. But um, it was brilliant, and uh, so I always thought it was him that had come from the island of the Mull, but actually, many, many years later on, when I did a bit more research into the family, I discovered that it wasn't him, it was his father, who was also, a, my grandfather was a shepherd, and my gran great-grandfather was also a shepherd, but he was the one that came over as a young man to the mainland working as a shepherd, and, and uh, I, I don't really believe that he ever went back to that island, uh, but th that continues on to the next song. But anyway, it's called Shenner's Song. I suppose I should have called it, now that I know a bit better than what I knew when I wrote it, I should have called it Great Shenner's Song. <laughs> I suppose. But we'll try it and see how we got on, and like I say, it's not a song I sing often, so... That's what's lovely about doing these wee live shows, I, I can get away with doing something goes pear-shaped then it doesn't really matter ever.
from the island of the mountains to the hills across our guile with a heart that is so broken with every weary mile and he'll never hear the whisper of his Hebridean on the thunder of the ocean as the mensch comes tumbling in and he's holding out he's holding out on the free on the ball line and he rests the tired shepherd with a gentle devon flows but inside there is a yearning no one really knows and in the quiet of the evening he would sing his island songs for the ashes of his fathers and the chill And these chains have not been broken And our freedom is not won And though many words are spoken We still wander weary on And there are a hundred questions And a thousand reasons why but our answers there somewhere in the Hebridean sky and he's holding out he's holding out on the ball line. Maybe have a wee bit of a global chorus to try it that way. I'll try it. And he's home. <laughs> Thank you very much, and that's my wee, the Shenner's so my wee song about my great Shenner. <laughs> and um, because when they came over, they they were made very they were made um, 
to feel very embarrassed about speaking Gaelic. In fact, they, they hid the fact that they spoke Gaelic, you know. But uh, they, uh, my, my dad, um, and sadly, my grandfather never taught my father to speak Gaelic, and so I, I don't have it myself. But uh, I always used to be fascinated as a little boy when I, um, I would go away for walks with my grand, with my Scherner, <laughs> and, uh, and he'd stop into this um, house that was just up the road from it was called Brett Cottage with an old lady called Mrs. McNeil that lived in it. And uh, she was a wonderful old lady. And uh, I remember, um, he, he, sh and she was from the island of Barra, and, they, and she spoke Gaelic. And I remember my grandfather would, um, she'd pour us a couple of glasses of milk for me and my sister. And then my, 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 my Shanner and the, old, and the old Mrs. McNeil would sit and talk Gaelic. And as kids, we'd be fascinated listening to them, you know, and the, the kind of funny sounds they were making. Anyway, this continues on to the next song because I, I uh, eventually did a bit more research into the family and uh, it's kind of a family, a wee bit of a historic family night tonight and uh, I, I did a bit more research into it. And there's a chorus in this song so I'm going to teach you the, the, the chorus but uh, yeah, I did a wee bit more research and found that uh, my... Great Shether had come from Kilbrennan in the island of Mull, and uh, he had been illegitimate. And um, I discovered that his, his mother, called Anne Minges, lived, uh, lived there. And it must have been terrible for her. No wonder he left when he was in his early 20s, because the, the stigma that would be attached at that time up on the west coast of that, uh, uh, with the, the strictness of the kind of Scottish church at the time up there, the Presbyterian church, it would have been terrible for her. And... Uh, um, and, and so I, f I felt, <laughs> and then the last record I've got of her on the, on the census, she, she was described as a pauper. And that means that, you know, she was being looked after by the, by the, the, the community. And uh, I kind of felt sad, and I thought that my, 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 my great Shannon had abandoned her. He never went back again, and that's what I thought, because he came over as a young man, and I thought this poor old lady was left on her own over there with the kind of shame of, uh, of what she... But eventually, I did a bit more research, and I found that when she was in her 80s, he must have got her, she died down in uh, um, Dune, it's not far from here. And so he must have got her over as she was an old lady to spend her last year. So I, 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 got, I got that wrong in this song. So it just shows you, you have to be very careful when you're writing songs about your family tree, that you make sure that you get the right information. But anyway, it's part of the story anyway. So what you sing is you sing, and it's all eternally you. It's all eternally you. Because uh, from that one old lady, uh, my, my great-grandfather my great -great -grandfather came over. He had sons. They became doctors and lawyers and engineers. And, uh, and she'd never, she didn't have anything to worry about. And I wish I could go back and tell her, you know. I've always wanted to go back and tell her that everything worked out fine, you know. And she was engineers and folk singers, you know. That, so uh, anyway, so... So we'll have a wee go. That you could see us, oh, it would cheer your weary heart. Oh, and look what's been done. We've torn the whole damn thing apart. And I wish that I could tell you you didn't have. What's become of the tragic life you had? And now it's all eternally you. So that's the bit that you sang, right? And it's all eternally you. Again, and it's all. All eternally you. He 
didn't want to leave you oh, But a young man must be brave Oh, when people will talk Oh, they would rather sin than see But oh, you little bright one has made his way alone Oh, the seed of your heart Into a forest grown And now it's all eternally you And it's all Thank you very much. So there's a, a couple of wee songs about my great grandparents, and uh, um, if you get, if you ever get a chance to visit Mull and go up to Kilbrennan, it's a fantastic place. You know, it's uh, really amazing, right on the west side of of, of Mull. And uh, in fact, my my great great grandparents are buried in the little Colbrennan churchyard and uh, I was reading the thing that uh, told because Iona you know the island of Iona is just across the water a little bit and that's where all the Scottish kings were were, were buried and uh, seemingly but the, when the Vikings were attacking the west side of Scotland the the, 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 the folk panicked and so they didn't bury their kings on Iona they buried them in little Colbrennan churchyard 
beside my great great grandmother and grandfather. So um, that, that was that's a, a, a nice wee story. That um, anyway, um, I'm going to do one more song, and this is a song which I don't do at all, but uh, and, and, uh, I'm going to have to change the tuning of this guitar a wee bit just to to do it. But um, yeah, and it's a bit of a depressing song to finish the wee the wee. Uh, the wee night off, but uh, anyway, thanks. I hope you've enjoyed the, the, the few songs, and uh, I'm just gonna do a wee quick change of tuning here. Uh, and uh oh. oh. Um, <laughs> and so, for any guitar players watching, I'm using a, 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 a C tune. Oh, I, I've got a wee, oh yeah, I, had a, I forgot I got these printed out. This was uh, some wee requests I should have read out earlier on. That first song, Resolution, was for Elsie Evans from Dis in Norfolk. And I know Dis in Norfolk really quite well because... Uh, I got married in this in Norfolk many, many years ago. It's too many years ago to, to even sort of contemplate, but it's fantastic. The only p problem with Norfolk is it's completely flat. And I'm kind of used to a few mountains. And I remember when I lived down there for a while, and uh, it was very difficult to find. You know, I like going out for walks. It was very difficult because it was all flat, and you didn't know. Anyway, but it's beautiful. But they had fantastic beer. Anyway, that was from Elsie Evans. And Shenner's song, this is an old request. We put it in the, in the Hat, and it came out of uh, Duncan's Hat for, for a Greg Lawson in Austin, Texas. And, uh, and I hope, I hope you may, might not be watching tonight, but uh, and Eternally You was for uh, Fanola Danon in Perth, Western Australia. So uh, hi, uh, Fanola. I hope you're uh, getting this loud and clear. Uh, I'm just going to have a wee mouthful of uh, Nigel's port. I think you should start making it and, and, and it'll be quite a nice brand, that, eh? Nigel's port. <laughs> Anyway, we'll try this wee song. Um. thing. It's always the smooth and the rough. It's always never ending. Okay? I told you it was a bit depressing. Wait a minute. It's always never enough. It is always a fleeting thing. It is always the smooth and Oh, 
you work so hard You take no rest You trade your precious time And strongest hearts Will do their best No mountain And it's always never enough It is always a fleeting thing It is always the smooth and the rough It is always never ending The day will end as all days must darkness gathers round broken dreams fall into dust and scatter all around and it's all Thank you very much. That's my wee song. <laughs> yeah, and it seems to me it doesn't matter how much you do, it's never enough, is it? You know, you know, as you go through life, you know, there's always a, a never-ending struggle um, of, to try and uh, keep things, keep things going. You know, what, and it's a bit like my Shadow of the Mountain song. A little bit. Anyway, that brings us to the end of another wee half an hour Saturday night, and I hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Many thank yous to the. Wonderful Tatty Faces. That was some fantastic uh, playing tonight, particularly from uh, Mr. Tatty Face. You know, he's got fingers of silver, so he has, when it comes to playing them lovely accompaniments. <laughs> anyway, um, I'll just, uh, all that's left for me to do now is to, to, to thank you very much uh, for joining us. Uh, to thank, it's just me and Jenny in the old school house here. I'd like to thank Jenny for doing the, for doing the buttons up the back. And, uh, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, now I always like to take a wee bit of a time to kind of, because these things all started out originally because of the, the crazy kind of times that we were living through. And I like to take a little bit of time to kind of 
thank and to think of all the, the, the care workers and the national health workers and the people that are out there. Things are not looking good at the moment, actually. In Scotland, I don't know where it, where it is in Europe, but, but they're kind of... The, the, the numbers of, uh, of uh, infections and things are starting to kind of soar again. And uh, it's, so it's not looking good and it's a wee bit kind of worrying. Um, but I hope you're all looking after each other and and and, and, all my, all, and strength to all the, 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 the NHS workers and the care workers and all the people who are kind of, you know, um, hope everything just uh, stays calm for you all. Um, anyway, uh, just the, the most important thing is that we all look after each other and we stay cheery and we kind of uh, have a great Christmas. Um, I'll have to remind you to buy your tickets for our little um, festive special next weekend. We've got an hour, it's a ticketed show next weekend and it's going to be an hour and you can buy your tickets on www.doogiemclainlive.com and we're going to try and have a wee... And we're going to have a try and have a week and a festive, um, festive hour for you uh, next weekend. Um, and uh, the tatty faces are very excited, you know. And um, anyway, so, <laughs> so look after each other, uh, stay cheery, and uh, smile like a tatty face. And um, and I'll see you next weekend. Um, and uh, um, you take care. Aye,